Hey guys, welcome back to another GTD Gamer 4 video. Today, I am going to be playing Roblox. And I'm going to be playing Prison Break today. And... So, this is my first Roblox video. I will be making other Roblox videos soon. But, it's my first one. And... So, this game that I will be playing today is actually very very awesome and I play it a lot see it's called prison life and so what we're going to be a prisoner and try to escape yes and when you was and when you escape you can return you can turn to a criminal which and this is the cafeteria this is a breakfast item which breakfast here is horrible see look at that horrible breakfast so I'm not going to eat it and this room right here that is locked will open soon is the cell room where all the prison cells are and in here is the guard room guards only guards can access that key card it can access every single room if you are a guard or if you're a criminal or a prisoner who has a key card now the best way to escape is to get a guard to open the door for you like this guy is a riot police and riot police have shields and better weapons than the normal police officers we will sneak in there to escape and oh, it's yard time. So in, this is the courtyard, which is my favorite part of the whole prison. And there already, because there's like two weapons out here, and I'm going to grab one right now. If this guy doesn't grab it, and I got it, I got the weapon. So, so I'm gonna stay away from her because she could beat me, and she's shooting me. So I'm going to run because I do not want to lose the weapon I just found. So I will find another guard that I'll take out and when you're on computer prisoners can punch you I cannot punch so I cannot fight back against her unless I can punch see she's harming me from punching and that guy he got into the guard room and that person is punching everybody and that guard is very dangerous so be careful oh I got got back up Duh. Now, uh, so we're trying to get the guard because we need key card, and the best way to do that is getting killing a guard. Actually, that's the only way to get key card in this game. It's killing guard. Once I get a key card in here, I'm out of here. Okay, no key card there. So you have to get a key card, and you have access to all the doors, and that is how you escape. So I will beat this guy. And he did not drop a key card. It takes a while because key card is uncommon. And other people take them. So it's hard to get a key card to escape. And the guards are arresting people. So I got to be careful not to get arrested. So you can see. He dropped a key card. And no one else took it. And I got it. So I'm going to escape on my own. Okay. So there is a little secret you can do when you escape. If you reset yourself, you can become a criminal. You do become a criminal as soon as you get out. And but you lose all the items that I have here, but I get two better weapons. But after I go over the wall, and I guess you could say take out that guard. I will go back in the prison. Are you? I will go help free the other prisoners who cannot free themselves. And a guard did not drop anything good. So we are going. So we, you can see here. I am now the only criminal, and we don't want one criminal, right? So I'm going to go. Go back in, and get more. Okay, so that guy escaped on his own. I'm going to. That means if there's a prisoner, that means there's a guard. So you always got to be careful not to get arrested. 
Yeah, you're you're a prisoner and you get killed. You actually just teleport back to the warehouse. And when you're pr when you're yeah, you're a criminal. You teleport to the warehouse if you die. And I am freeing the other prisoners, and they are not attacking me because I am helping them. And they will soon all escape. And I think the prisoners are mad at me. Okay, everyone. Okay, a lot of people have key cards. And so that guy's a key card. That guy's running for it. I'm here to help prisoners, not just go on my own, as you as I did earlier. And there's a guard, and that is bad. Oh, okay. So some guards help the prisoners, and that's what I, uh, that's what I'm doing as well. I'm helping the prisoners as well. Yep, guard room, there is chaos in the guard room, and we are escaping. So there are going to be a lot of criminals at the moment, and that guard is part of the prison, with the prisoners, and I'm, and that guest doesn't really, oh, that guy can get out on his own, but prisoners sometimes actually attack, um, criminals so I'm going to help this guy because he's not attacking me as you can see I've been tased I have been arrested so you could say I helped get all those prisoners out you could say I did a good thing while getting arrested so I am going to be switching teams. I'm going to switch as a guard for a little while. So yeah, when you're a guard, you actually can do some pretty cool stuff. So this is the guard room. This is the riot police armor. There's shield, armor, weapons. This stuff's still coming soon. This, probably, this stuff will never actually be a thing in the game because it's been like that for years. And here is the taser. I will show you what happens when you zap a prisoner with it or a stun gun. They fall down and they are not injured. Handcuffs just arrest them. This is the more powerful weapon, which I was using when I was a prisoner. You cannot arrest a prisoner unless they have... They, you can arrest criminals. You can arrest prisoners if they're in the wrong place. Like, if there's a prisoner in the courtyard and it's lunchtime, you can arrest them. And, and like, if you cannot kill a prisoner who has no weapon... And if you do, you have, if you kill two more, you become a prisoner. And I saw a guard do it. And, yes. Yep, and if you get Robux, you can buy the Riot Police Game Pass, which the guy with the black, this guy right here. This guy has the Riot Police stuff. This guy is a normal guard. And if you're in this area, you cannot get arrested. And if you have a weapon and you are a prisoner, Guards can kill you, but if you do not have a weapon, guards can't kill you. And so I want to show you what happens when you use handcuffs. Okay, almost got it. Got one. Actually, no, I didn't. All right, now I got one. See, that's what happens. And there is another person who is stunned, which I will try to get. So, so they are have more powerful weapons than me. Which is alright, because you just spawn back here. It's cool being a guard, because you have access to everything. Even the warehouse, which we are going to go visit the warehouse as a guard. Yes, we will go do that before the video is over. Yeah, so... I'm going to go out this way. And I'm going to be a guard. So... And that person out there that is most likely to be a criminal that person right there is most likely to be a criminal so before the video ends we are going to stop them and here's a guard to help me because it's always good to have backup when you're facing criminals they always have those really strong weapons if that's a criminal that is a criminal and guys that 